Multiplying a one digit number by a one digit number. Starry, I hope you remember the two different ways in which you can arrange digits when you have to multiply them. One is the horizontal arrangement, as is seen when you write your tables. So, three fours are twelve is written as three multiplied by four equals twelve. The same digits when written in the vertical arrangement will be 3 multiplied by 4 equals 12. Here Starry, both 3 and 4 are one digit numbers. So we have just multiplied a one digit number by another one digit number. Let me show you how. First, you place both 3 and 4, one below the other, in the unit's place. Next, you say the 4 times table up to 4 threes. 4 ones are 4. 4 twos are 8. 4 threes are 12. Hence, the product is 12. So we write 2 in the units place. And 1 in the tens place. Wasn't that easy, Starry? Now let's try another set of one digit numbers. Let us multiply six by nine. We will now say the 9 times table up to 9 sixes. So, 9 sixes are 54. The product is 54. We write 4 in the units place. And 5 in the tens place. Now let me see if you have understood what I have just taught you. Let's multiply using tables. In the first example, we say the 6 times table till 6 threes. So, 6 threes are 18. The product is 18. In this example, we say the 7 times table till 7 sevens. 7 sevens are 49. The product is 49.
Here we say the nine times table till nine fives. Nine fives are forty five. The product is forty five. Now that you have understood multiplication, let me show you something interesting. Look at this figure. You have to help me fill the correct numbers in the boxes. Let's begin. We have to get the number 18 as the product. We will first say the 6 times table till we reach 18. So, 6 threes are 18. The number that goes into the first box is... 3. But Starry, I hope you remember that we get the same product when the multiplier and multiplicand change places. So, 6 times 3 equals 3 times 6 is equal to 18. Hence, the number in our next box should be 6. Wasn't that easy? Here, Starry, we have to get the number 12 as the product to fill in the different boxes. We begin with the 3 times table till we reach 12. 3 fours are 12. The number in the first box is 4. But remember, we get the same product when the multiplier and multiplicand change places. So 3 times 4 equals 4 times 3 is equal to 12. Hence, it follows that the number in the second box will be 3. We next say the 2 times table till we reach 12. 2 sixes are 12. The number in the next box is 6. But 2 times 6 equals 6 times 2 is equal to 12. And so, the number in the last box has to be 2. Let us now revise what we have learned.
Here we have to get the number 36 as the product. So, let us fill the different boxes. We begin with the 4 times table. 4 times dash is 36. 4 nines are 36. So the number in the first box is 9. But 4 times 9 equals 9 times dash equals to 36. 9 times 4 equals to 36. The number in the second box should be 4. And for the third box, we will say the 6 times table till we reach 36. 6 times dash is 36. 6 sixes are 36. The number in the last box has to be 6. Great Starry! You have finally understood how to multiply one-digit numbers.